This is the sad story about our little monastery kestrels. The story remembers a little the one in 2020. Watch till the end to see if it will have a happy ending. As the little ones are big enough to stay at home by themselves, their mother can go hunting and support the father. Unfortunately, this is also the last time she was seen on camera and around the monastery. Good morning. Where is Mama? The chicks are hungry. Their father is coming to the nesting box, but does not bring any food. Luckily, we did notice that the little ones did not get anything to eat for three days. In that stage of their evolution, it is crucial that they get food. So we talked to a falconry expert what we could do and we decided that we will give them a fighting chance and that we will feed them. So we started to feed them little pieces. But wait, didn't we have five falcons? One is missing. It looks that one did jump out of the nesting box and flew away. At first we did feed them little pieces of chicken chicks. It was important that they did not see that humans are feeding them so that they do not associate humans with food. At first they were hesitant, but hunger prevailed. After looking for hours for the fifth chick, we did find it hiding behind some stairs and put it back home. The siblings are finally reunited. Daddy is coming by. He does not bring any food, but he tries to steal from his kids. They do not like it at all. Time for some muscle exercises. We had to feed them at least once a day, but at least all stayed in the box and did not try to escape. They get braver and braver by the day. On the fourth day of feeding, we already provide them with whole animals as food. They are able to take it apart by themselves now. Is that you? Today, we can find chicks and mice on the menu. And here he is again, daddy on his daily raid. But the young don't want to share and protect their food. And more wing training.
Now they use their wings to jump on top of the nesting box. but they are still a little clumsy. One, two, three, four. Today is the day when the first one is having his first flight. Flying makes very hungry. By now there are many little falcons flying around the monastery and inspecting the surroundings. Who works out a lot needs to feed a lot. It's an advantage if you can fly. From now on, all the little ones are able to fly. They now practice a lot and explore the region. Now as the little ones are not in their nesting box, we can feed them a little easier. We start to give them even quails to feed on. And here he comes again. Papa tries to steal some food, but as always, the little ones do not like it. After all this excitement, they need a snack first. What is happening now? It's maybe a little too big. Daddy is on a raid again.
Let's try some hunting techniques. Young falcons are all over the place. A daily routine. Food is served. And here he is again. Papa's looking for some free food. But there is no such thing as free lunch. but there is enough food for everyone. I would like to order some food, please. The little ones seem to be successful hunters. They come to the nesting box to seek shelter, but they do not take the food. This is also the last time we did see the little ones. 